Five, my YouTube family and friends, what's going on? How everybody doing? Let me tell you something. Miss Netta said that she would rather be a white woman because the white women is not in her comments talking about her and Charles. Okay, that's what Miss Netta said. Now I don't. Let me tell y'all something. Now y'all know everybody been down on 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 Miss Netta. Everybody Miss Netta been talked about every day, all day, twenty four hours a day, right? But let me tell y'all something. Like I told y'all before, she Obama. She Obama. That's, that's first and foremost. She is Obama. And I can say, because I've been down south four years now, there's a total difference in the way southern folks, and I ain't trying to fit nobody, I'm just telling you my truth and my experience. They think differently than we do up top, right? Miss Netta is Obama, and all she was trying to say is black women's, the black women's is the ones been harassing her, talking about her. And 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 uh, uh, getting on her nerves, the black women. How she knew they was all black, I don't know that part, right? But Miss Netta said she would rather be a white woman. I don't really think Miss Netta understood the full magnitude of what she said. I don't think she knew that that was going to blast off on her like that by what she said. Listen, black women, we already know we are the least protected and the most talked about, right? Um, I see it in every aspect of my life, and the older I get, the more I see it, right? Miss Netta said she'd rather be a white woman. Now, I'm trying to figure out if Miss Crocodile Face really meant that, or she was just mad at the time, right? Um, and she said that. And then you know what else? Black women, we are the most, we support everybody and everything. That's why, that's why. The LGBTQ community and all them, uh, you know, why they so up there now and can't nobody say nothing about them. That was us. That was us. We did that. We did that. That's our fault. We did that. That's because we love it and we love everybody. Come on in. Come on in, baby. Come on. We got you. Come on. And then you turn on as soon as you, soon as you get in there or think you're in there, you turn on us. We do, we do the most of everything, black women. We do. We do. We do. We take you in. And if you notice, anytime especially a black man, anytime something go awry, who they call a black woman, right? Miss Netta going to have to apologize. And I don't know if she's apologized today, but she's going to have to straighten that up. She's going to have to tighten that tighten that statement up, Miss Netta. You know, I kind of think I understood. She was saying, it's you, black women, that keep talking about me. That's why I'd rather be a white woman because black women keep talking about me. I think that's what she kind of meant. That ain't what you say. That ain't nothing you say out loud, Netta. You don't say that out loud, child. You don't say that out loud, right? So, uh, Miss Netta said that, right? Miss Netta and them over there living their best life. See, I'm, this is what I'm saying. Miss Netta and them been living in Bama in their trailer in their own little world. Then TikTok come out during the pandemic. Because I, I'm, I'm, I can't even hardly get on TikTok too much because you can go down a rabbit hole. You can be down there for hours, right? And lost sleep and everything. So, Miss Netta and them just been enjoying their little life on the TikTok. Because I like me some TikTok too. Right, I love TikTok. I love to uh, upload my videos, and I love to watch it. Right, it's very time consuming, very entertaining. So in her world, all she knew was Charles and TikTok. That's it. She's claiming she know nothing about LGBTQ and none of that. What she said, even though she is a, I don't even know how what what she is, a gay man woman. Right, so she wasn't identified with the gays the way properly. You know, they pop about their terms. He say, he, she, it, this and that. I don't know all the, all the, all the ways they identify. But Ms. Netta didn't, under, didn't understand that. She didn't identify with that. And they got mad with her. Nah, the gays just got over that. Nah, the black women's. The black women's is mad with you, Ms. Netta. I ain't mad because I understand you a Bama. I, I just understand you a Bama. And your brain don't, don't. Your brain don't work like everybody else's. I understand. I ain't mad at you at all. I think it's funny, right? Uh, you know, I ain't mad at you. I ain't mad that you got a man. And I ain't mad that you uh, going around the country picking up your coins. I ain't mad at all. But you got to watch what you say, Miss Netta. You got to watch because your core base, black men ain't looking at you like that unless they gay. Black men ain't looking at Regular black men is not studying you, Miss Netta. They're not. They're not. Your core base is black women. Maybe a few white women sprinkled up in there just for entertainment purposes, just trying to figure out what's going on with the situation. But black women is your core base. You do not ever offend your core where you're getting your money from, ever. 
That's a thought that you keep between you and God. You don't want to put that out there like that, Miss Nana. Ain't say nobody told you. Black women is your core. Black women is your core. You offended your whole core. That's your money. I, when I look, see, I hadn't really, I didn't, I don't really look at them on the TikTok, right? Not really. Uh, I look today, and uh, their views is in the thousands and the millions. Like, girl, the black women, the ain't white women. Do you think them white women's now? Cause they ain't. Trust me, they might look at you for a minute and laugh at their friends, but they ain't. They not, right? Black women is your core, so you need to straighten that out. Now I don't know if you made an apology as of yet, but you need to get on that microphone, just like you do for Charles, and you need to apologize. To us. Like I said, I don't really need it because I think it's funny. I don't really need it. Right? But, you know, the people that watch you all the time, been watching you since you started with your skits and can on and so forth, they need the apology, child. You mess around and you won't have no, you won't have no, um, you won't have no followers, right? Like, I know people in, just in regular life who, um, they was on top of whatever they was on top of. And then they start offending people and think they better than who they are. And then they end up with zero. So, Miss Nutter, you better watch it, girl. You better come apologize. You better call up the Black Women's Association and tell them I want to make a public apology. Okay, Nutter? All right. Now, that's it. That's all. That's it. That's all. Bye-bye. <laughs> make sure that y'all... Uh, like, share, comment, and subscribe. I got to tell y'all that part.